hello everyone and welcome back to my channel in today's tutorial we are going to learn how can we insert an image in our website so without any further delay let's dive into the video for that i just open up my notepad plus plus and here i'm going to write down the basic html structure so for any html code we need the basic structure where every tag is inside the HTML and two of the very important tags are the head tag and the body tag. Inside the head tag, I'm going to write down the title of my page. For the title of my web page, I'm going to write down Hot Air Balloon Show. So it is a very famous festive, mostly held on the Labor Day. And here I'm writing down the title of my web page as you can see so now that we have written down our title let's dive into the body so in the body i'm just going to write a very simple heading for our today's topic and i'm using the h2 tag for my heading here and now we will use the image tag so as the name says image tag the tag used for that is img and the image tag has two attributes one is the source and another is auth in the source we basically write down the location of our picture what i mean that is where is our location so as you can see i'm just searching hot air balloon show in the google chrome and i'll click on image and here are lots of image i'm just going to choose one so now i'm going to open the image in an individual tab so in the if i open the image individually in a tab you can see at the top of the search bar we have a location or a url for my image we're just going to copy that and paste it inside the source so this is where uh, the image is and in the alt i'm just going to write a text which means if the image is not there, the text will be shown. You will be, uh, I'll give you the example later on. Here I'm saving the file with an extension of HTML. And now I'm going to open up my file in my Chrome browser. So as you can see, we have got our topic and the image is showing correctly in here. So let's go back to our Notepad++ ID and see if somehow the somehow the link is wrong or uh, for example it, because it's a it's a image from the website so if the image is deleted what will happen then so for that i'm just using a wrong url and as you can see the text balloon image is showing there instead of the image so I'm going to remove the unwanted letter from my URL and save the file again. Reload the page and we've got our image back. It's always a good idea to save the image in your local machine. So even if the image is deleted from the website, it is stored in your local machine and available for your website. So now I'm just downloading the image and we have the image available in our local machine. I'm going to now uh, remove the URL from the source and instead of that I'm going to use my saved image and use the name as the name we have saved the image also make sure to um, include the file extension correctly as well and now I will be reloading my page so here I have to use jpg instead of jpeg i'll correct that and save the file again and reload my page in my chrome browser and now that we have got our image what i'm going to do is resize the image so that it will look good in our website for resizing the image i'm going to use the width attribute and here i'm going to set the width to 500 pixel so that it looks good and i'll save and reload the page now that we have resized our image i'm just adding some inline css to make the uh, our page look more beautiful 
so here I'm just adding some color for my text and making the text to appear in the middle uh, if you don't know much about uh, CSS or inline CSS don't worry too much because in later video we will learn in more detail how to use inline CSS or how to design in our HTML page uh, also I'm adding some caption for my picture and I will be adding the same style for uh, the caption of my uh, picture also I'll be adding some uh, space by uh, adding some brick uh, tag at the top of the picture so that the image will appear in the middle and it will look good in our website so using image tag makes our page more attractive and interesting so I hope you like that video don't forget to comment down below and please share the video with your friends, subscribe to my channel, press the bell icon to get notification for my upcoming videos.